Welcome to today's math lesson. In this lesson, we are going to learn all about number facts to 20. At the end of this lesson, you will identify the terms used for addition and subtraction, and you will recall the number facts to 20, number pairs 4 to 20, and bonds to 10 and 20. For this lesson, you will need the words number, bonds, make, plus, add, and 20. Let's recap. When we learned about number bonds, we learned that a number bond has a whole and two parts. So two parts make a whole. So some frogs are sitting on the lily pads. A few jump off and hide in the water. Can you make out how many are hiding? You can even draw a part hole diagram to show the fact you are using to help you. So let's try this one. Here we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So we have 8 in the 1 lily pad and 1, 2, 3. So we have 8 and 3. If you've guessed, if you've guessed that 8 that 5 of them are missing, well done. Because first we had 8 of them. A few jumped off and then we've got three. So five of them were missing. So five and three make eight. Let's try another one. Here we have one, two, three, four, five, six. Some jumped off. And now how many do you how many do you think jumped off? So there were six on here and now there are zero. So if you've guessed that it's 6 and 0 make 6. Well done. You are correct. Which missing jigsaw piece now makes the number 20? So we have the number 19. Which of these pieces do I need to join to make the number 20? If you've guessed that I need to join the number 1, excellent. You are correct. Now we have the number 5. Which piece do I need to join to make the number 20? If you've guessed that I need to make join 15, you are correct. Super job! Now I have the number 12. Can you guess which number needs to, to be added to make the number 8? If you've guessed 8, super awesome. You are a star. Now we have 17. If you've guessed that the number 3 works, you are correct. Well done. Here we have the number 7. If you've guessed that the number 13 joins, well done. You are a star. Since we've learned a lot about number facts and addition, you will already know lots of number facts. And you can use these to make number facts. So we already know that 4 plus 3 equals to 7. So we can use that to work out what is 14 plus 3. If we have 14 plus 3, we can see that 14 plus 3 equals to 17. We are just adding the 10. Try using blocks or number charts or anything to help you prove this. Here we have 4 plus 3 equals to 7. And here we just added another 10 frame and it will equal to the same number, just with a 10 in front of the one. So if we have 10 minus 5 equals to 5, we can also see that 20 minus 5 equals to 15. We can use this to work out the same thing. 10 minus 5 equals to 5. And 20 minus 5 equals to 15. You can use these, uh, this concept and this idea to help you work the, the following out. We have 4 plus 3 equals to 7. 14 plus 3 equals to 7. 3 plus 4 equals to 7. 3 plus 14 equals to 7. Now we have 7 minus 4 equals to 3. If we have 17 minus 3 equals to 14, and we have 7 minus 3 equals to 4, we can also see that 17 minus 14 equals to 3. 
So you can try this out with any number. We have come to the end of today's lesson. I hope you all enjoyed it. Assalamu alaikum.